Hello children. We are here today because we actually are going to try to put some work into this. Yes, I've been procrastinating on this piece hard. Like it is not even appropriate how hard I've been procrastinating on this piece because I really want to do it. Like I really want to do it because it looks so cool. At least from my, okay, it, it could look cool if it looked better. That's what we're trying to do. <laughs> we're trying to make it look better. <laughs> so I kind of got her rough sketch down. So now we're going to go to Zuko. How's everybody doing today? How is work? How's life? That's too thick. That's still too thick. That's better. Oh my god, I actually did kind of a chin. So, fun story. I've been doing art since I was a kid. Um, started with stick figures, really loved abstract, loved 3D, loved colored pencils. I love a lot of things that are art. But, um, I was actually into character art a lot heavily at one point. <laughs> Not gonna lie, if I hadn't have taken my hiatus in high school, I probably... I would be a hell of a lot better. Oh, man. Not gonna lie, I'd probably be a breeze level if I would've kept at it. No, actually, I think I would've been a little past breeze level. Because I started very young on character art. Oh, that's my iCloud storage. Okay, I was like, what do you mean our storage is almost full? I just fucking miss. What is this? What is this? Hold on, y'all. Um. I saw one day. What just happened? I don't even know what just happened. What just happened? Did you try to call me? Okay, y'all get to experience some of my conversations at the same time. I look over and my phone has like the call screen, like a call's coming in and I'm like, the fuck? I didn't hear it, it's not making any noise, it's not even vibrating, even though it's on vibrate, what's up with that? Oh, 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 hold on, we got a response. LOL, let me finish this video and I'll call you back. Tammy will understand this. Tammy, if you're watching this video, you should comment and I'll give you some merch. Like, for real, anytime I mention I'll hand out some merch if you comment, if you really comment, A, that knows, that knows, that way I know you're watching the video and paying attention. <laughs> B, it gives me an excuse to hand out merch because it's it's fun. I enjoy it. So it's already been sent out in the mail, and I'm pretty sure it's already been delivered, so I'm pretty confident talking about it. Um, the March Patreon winner is uh, Alex Miller. He's one of our patrons on here. He's a pretty awesome dude. He's a freaking rap star, man. Like, for real. For real, for real. And all my patrons can see each other. So if you want to congratulate, by all means, you can, and say hello. He's a fantastic dude. Um, he got himself some stickers this month, which actually were pretty darn cool. If I do say so myself, I, uh, so when I ordered stickers, stickers the first time through my manufacturer, um, I ordered transparent, assuming that the border would be transparent, but no, it was the entire, entire thing. So I was like, oh, okay. So it kind of looks weird on my iPad case, but it is what it is, you know. Um, I'm trying to put some muscle tone on this, but it's just kind of, it's not working with me. I want them to have some beefy arms. That's why we do like 18 sketches.
But uh, anywho, so I ordered uh, at least one of each size that I offer. So there's 2 inch, 3 inch, 4 inch, and I think 6 inch if I remember right. Um, I think it's 6 inch. But anyway, the, the biggest one that I got was way too big for the packaging that I picked out. And I was like, I don't know what to do with that information. So we decided to just keep it in that case. So, yeah. Oh, all right. We are back. That's to take me a quick little break for a moment. But it is all good. We are working on this weird arm because it just, it just done diddly don't. Look right, man. It don't. <laughs> it's like I don't know what I need. So there's an interesting story behind these two that I made up, and it got really intense. So I like a lot of romance stuff. I like romance books. I like Nora Roberts, Time Traveler's Wife. I eat that shit up. Um, but these two have a rough past. So in, in my take on Avatar, kind of like how I did Kaya with Naruto, this is Kaya with Avatar. It's completely for me. It's not for anybody. You know, so no hate. But uh, her and Aang... There are two avatars in my universe. It's her and Aang. They are brother and sister. They're both airbenders. Uh, to kind of summarize in whole, he tries to kill her after finding out she's the avatar. However, before he found out she was the avatar, he fell in love with her and they were in love together. <clears throat> so that kind of put a bit of a tip on their relationship. Uh, and then over the years, he kept trying to attack the avatar. When he finally came around to the good side, she still didn't trust him. Ergo, I don't really want them holding hands. I just want her holding his wrist with her eye open. Just kind of like, I don't know. Because at the time that um, I drew this, I was watching, I think it was the Western Air Temple. And I kind of took it from that. Kind of like, oh, neither of them were quite sure what path they were going on yet. So it's like, hmm... His arm just looks so wimpy. Like, okay, hold up. I gotta redo this whole shenanigan. Leave that. Get rid of this. I don't want him to be, like, super buff. I mean, he is Zuko. He is pretty darn too buff. Mm -mm. This might be a two-parter. I don't know if I'm actually going to sit out here and finish this piece. I might go back inside for a little bit. But I at least might get Zuko's sketch done. Okay, we're making some progress. Making some progress. I'm gonna do another sketch after this because that is that it looks like his arm's broken. Oh my god. Well, let's try that again, kids. Jeez. Okay, I'm I can I can work with that a little bit better. It's still not perfect, but I can deal with it for right now. <laughs> it's tolerable is the best way to say it. <clears throat> Oof. <laughs> Uh, that broken oh it looks like a little chicken wing but i'm hating on my art really hard right now I do that a lot I, sh I really need to stop doing that <laughs> i'm just kind of giving him some crazy hair at the moment Just giving him something. Hmm, excuse me. Got the burps. I 
I think we're going to call it for right now. No. No. See, it's going to bug me. It's going to bug me. Um, nope, 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 nope. I honestly thought somebody was coming out here and I was like, damn it. So I have really bad body dysmorphia. I don't like being watched when I make these videos because it makes me feel really uncomfortable. It has nothing to do with the person. It's just I don't like being watched. That's like even at work. I I hate training at work, any job, because they, they watch you to make sure you're doing your stuff right. And it's like, oh my god, I'm so uncomfortable right now. <laughs> You didn't think I was just going to leave it like that. Okay, now we're going to call it. Okay. We are back today. I ate some dinner. It was very good. It was potatoes. And, uh... Crap, what else was it? Corn. Uh, see... <clears throat> We're going we're gonna to talk about this today, like halfway through the video. If like anyone's actually paying attention, we're going to talk about some deep shit. But we had corn, chicken, that's what it was, and potatoes, that's what it was. So with high stress and high anxiety comes memory loss. And it gets really bad some days. Um... Yeah, it gets to the point, Some, I, it's not like, I've never forgotten my name or anything like that. I've never forgotten, like, my husband or anything like that, so it's not like, I don't know, diabolically horrible, but at the same time, it's like, okay, I'm 26, I shouldn't be having this type of issue at this age, like, at all. I don't know why did their eyes different. I kind of actually want the eyes to be the same. That pupil's a little terrifying, but <laughs> that pupil, though. Ooh. Okay, she coming. She coming together. She coming together. Okay. Okay. I see you. This is gonna be a long video. I'm just letting you know that now. It's gonna be a long video. Trying to decide what I want to do here, because I need to do another layer. Because I need to get, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hide him, because we're gonna work on her. I want it to be a little less opaque, opaque, opaque. Tupac. We're gonna go in with my. So for those that are new, I have a couple different ranges of brushes. I, I purchase some. I get some free. It really just kind of depends, but, um. Fucking memory loss. Uh, these brushes right here. Okay, so these are probably my favorite four brushes that I have. They're all the same pen as the Studio Pen. This one has no streamline, so it just kind of does its zigzag. This one has max streamline, so it gets like those nice curves. And the same thing with these two. No streamline, max streamline. Just the difference with those is I have the ink as rainbow effect. So we're going to go with my studio pen with max streamline. We're going to go right in here and we're going to 
We're gonna make that smaller. We're just gonna go in here. This is not the final line. This is just something that I wanna get out of the way. That way I can kinda see what the full picture is gonna look like. Get that out of there. Okay. There we go, I wanted that line on that. This, however, can go the fuck away. There. <laughs> that just looked weird. Okay. Just getting some of these lines in, making sure that arm is on fleek. Boom. So the bottom of this is gonna fade out kind of like how I had it in the painting, but I'll actually do it a little bit better since it'll be digital art. I have a plan of how I wanna do that, I think. Actually, yeah, no, I do know how I wanna do it. <sighs> so for now, I'm just gonna draw a line. But I want to get some basic line art done. That way I can kind of see what all I'm working with. Because right now everything's just kind of a jumbled mess. And it's like, okay, I need to organize my shit. Get it back together. Like Morty said, get your shit, put it in a box. Get it together. Get your shit together. Sorry, there's a little cattywampus at this point of her life. It's at this stage, it's season three, so the final season. this okay it needs some work still but I'm here for it so this will be the start of like part two for this scenario because it got a little little crazy a little, little crazy actually I know it's screwed I'm just gonna keep all these in one video so it's just gonna be one long video <laughs> nice see we make these decisions up as we go sometimes it's fun so last time we got Actually, for you guys, it'd just be a couple seconds ago, but for me, it was last night. We're doing some final lines, just so I can kind of see how everything is going to look.
There we go. And this is still not the final line. We're just kind of going. And we're just kind of, I mainly just want to clean up everything, really. Because everything's just kind of messy right now. I'm listening. So when I, uh, for those that are new, when I tend to draw, I like to listen to like old video game music from when I was a kid or just like watch old video game play. And it entertains the holy moly out of me. Okay, let's get this eye. Okay. There's a couple things definitely that need to be fixed and improved on. But hey, that's why we're here. <clears throat> so we're going to go back to her. Make the line a little bit bigger. Am I doing the flesh colors yet? No, I want to get the line work of this completely finalized and then go back over the color. <coughs> that way too, I can fix any errors along the way.
hands are not my strong suit. <clears throat> I can safely say that. Okay, she is almost done with her line art. That looks a lot cleaner for me. Okay, that looks a lot cleaner. Oops, I forgot something. I'm looking at that and I'm like, something's gone.
see, his arm just still doesn't look right to me. Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make another layer, just so I can work on this arm. How did I have it here? See, I feel like I had it better here in the original picture, but it's like... Ugh. Let me finish everything else first real quick. Let's just give him some crazy eyes. Oh my god, that was terrifying. <laughs> it was just like, I'm here. <laughs> okay. I wasn't supposed to be on that layer. Anyway, we're gonna, we're gonna fix that. <laughs> oh no, I messed up. Get rid of that. Okay. Zuko's a defined dude. If I give it an elbow. See, I'm not the best with... Oh, that's that line. Okay, never mind. Genuinely, guys, I think that's going to be as good as I'm going to be able to get that. Oh, no! So we're going to leave it. There we go. Put his neck in there. Sweet. And then same thing with that. <clears throat> okay, I think we're ready. So I'm actually going to try to take some of these colors directly from this palette. That's what I'm going to try to do. Oops, I totally forgot. I have to take care of her... Her scar. So... In my... So I... I'll go on another tangent in a second because that just reminded me of something. Um... Her and Zuko are the same in the terms of they both have a scar. So when I was talking earlier about their relationship, they were in love and then he found out she was the Avatar and tried to kill her. In turn of him trying to kill her, he ended up burning a huge chunk of her shoulder. So I gotta remember to put that in here. Because that is like important. like, hella important. Seems really pale. That's gray. You can't lie to me. That is gray. How about up here? That is still gray. Oh, that's even on the blue scale. Oof. Okay. 
I'm actually I'm not actually gonna take these colors from the thing. I'm gonna adjust them. Because I'm not feeling these colors, to be honest. I'm gonna keep the um green, because I like that for her eyes. This needs to be more red and more deep. I need a gold. Oops, I don't want to set it to current color. That was my bad. I want a little more gold for her shirt. Get into some orange. A little bit of a darker orange. The skin, though. The skin. That is where I have a problem with. So I'm going to use that for her. He's going to be a little bit more of a peach color. It's going to be just a very faint difference. I should probably make his little... It's not really dark, though. Zuko's pretty pale. There we go. I like that a little bit better. Okay. And then, of course, black for their hair. But I'm going to make their hair a little bit off black. That way I can outline it. And then his eyes are kind of gold. So we're going to put some gold. Actually, more orange. So we're going to put some orange in there. I need brown for her pants. <clears throat> Not that shade. Help us get the green guy. He's that shade. Yes. yes. No. See, I'm not feeling that. It's not as that. That's what it is. It's not as that. <laughs> okay. think we're ready. I'm just going to put a couple more detail lines in here. That way I can go over it. Um, it's, it, it's all flicks. That's, I, that's the best I can explain because it's flicks. <laughs> Break your wrist trying to go faster. <laughs> Swish and flick. Sorry. There we go, get some more lines in his hair. Not a ton, but just, just a little, you know, just kind of, just get zazzy with it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Get those eyebrows on fleek. Okay. Somebody take the yep. <laughs> there we go. Okay, the nose looks a little more defined. We're just adding in just details, really. Make that a little bit of a bulge. Sweet. Okay, we are ready. I still need this image, so I'm gonna keep it. I'm just gonna hide it in the background is what I'm gonna do. Um, wait, where do we want to start with this? I'm actually breaking a sweat finally. <laughs> where do we want to start? I'm putting y'all up on my desk. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so I want to start. Let's start with her hair. Let's 
gives us an opportunity to fix any issues with the hair. So that is her hair. <clears throat> we're going to make a layer underneath and then we're going to go in for her skin. I need just a little bit of a darker color for the outline of her skin. We're going to do the same for Zuko because I want their skin to kind of pop a little bit but basically the outlines are just going to be darker versions of every color. <laughs> That's how I like to do it. Let me change the hue a little bit of this. Um, let's see. We're going to go... Oops, I didn't mean to do that. We want this because I'm going to work on her skin. Too pointy. There we go. I actually like that a lot better. Yeah. I gotta work on Brady's commission today, guys. I have been procrastinating on that so hard, mainly because the original was deleted and it's like. <laughs> okay. So we're gonna work on that a little bit later, I think, too. skin. Get those collarbones. Actually, I got light. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to do a second layer real quick for her eyebrows. We're going to go back to the skin and we're going to put in actually the eyebrows and the eyes I'm going to have on the same layer. She's going to be done, both of these are going to be done in many different layers. I'm probably going to do her first, shadow her, combine her layers, and then do Zuko's. That way I don't run out of space. Because I ain't about that life. I don't want to be running out of space when I'm trying to do something. <laughs> it's like, ah. Y'all, mm -mm. so I'm a big fan of The Legend of Zelda. You know, obviously, anybody that knows me is aware that I go cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. 
Someone decided to introduce an obscene fan theory that Link and Zelda are brother and sister. I'm not about that life. I'm not about that life. I am one of those that is gung-ho for the romance of Link and Zelda. It's like, it's one of those things, it's like, if it happens, it happens. Cool, if it doesn't happen, it's okay. We all know it's still there. So I'm doing everything above her skin. That way I can have those smooth lines over the top. I don't know what's happening here. There we go. Accidents were made, but things were fixed. Yes. Go is something to drink, my... Watch the Dark Alliance trailer. He says it looks awesome, but it says it's not coming out until 20, uh, uh, 2042. I was like, no, no, June 22nd. <laughs> I heard you say June 22nd. I was going to ask what you were talking about. Because it looks fun. It looks real fun. <laughs> We're gonna name that one and okay. Oh, that's a chicken. I thought it was a cat about to fight. I did forget for a second that I was recording. Sorry, y'all. I got a little into this. You can tell when I get into it because I get quiet. You just you just get on a roll. So we're gonna do his eyebrows. Now we're going to do his skin. Totally forgot to do the eye. Okay, there's the skin. We're gonna go on top. 
when we do... I lied. Let's do the gold first. Today, Zerg. Okay, now we're gonna go in with his clothes. I want that to be a little bit more red. I actually want this underneath the gold. I said underneath. There we go. Do as I say. Never as I do. And then I'm just making these into their own groups, that way I don't get confused. Except for that. I'm going to name this. Zuko. Z <coughs> Zulu. Zuko. Let's try that again. There we go. Okay, so let me do her eyes, because I totally forgot. Moxie. Oops. Found one little spot. There we go. Oops. make a change to her oh, tummy, I guess. There we go. Beautiful. 
beautiful. I'm gonna take a break for a sec. Would you look at that? It magically colored itself in. What? So I think this is like part. I don't even know. I think part eight of this. I'm determined to get this finished today, y'all. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. So we are in two. Um. Yeah, we're in two. Um. I don't want to render yet. Let's get the background going first. Let's get that line out of there. Actually, I'm going to keep the initial sketch layer because I'm going to make a cool video with that later for TikTok. That's mainly just a memo for myself. <laughs> so we're going to go to Kaya. We're going to go... So this is where chaos begins. So we're gonna do a clipping mask over her shirt. We're gonna get some shadowing in here. I always use my soft airbrush. I think I got that one for free. And then I really like this watercolor brush for like the blending of it. I like the look, it gives it a nice look. I'm in my room and I'm not wearing my glove. What is wrong with me? Literally bought that glove for this. Fuck. Okay. I want a little. Oops, I don't want mask. I'm sorry. There we go, I'm just stabbing the paper, jeez. I'm gonna go with a bit of a lighter yellow. So I want a little bit of highlight like on her boobs, just a little bit. And again, we ain't getting crazy. You know, she, we ain't getting crazy here. Just kind of buff that out a little bit. Or actually gotta take that because I like where it's positioned but I want to just kind of lower the opacity of it a little bit I want to actually add another line of detail to her face not with the airbrush I want my ink And then same with him. I actually want a little bit more... Where's his... his outline? There we go. Okay. Um, excuse me. Where did that come from? Just look down, there's a big old green street. Get out of there. Okay. So that's okay. I'm getting confused already on my layers. I'm so sorry, guys. Okay. So we're going in with this orange shade. So a lot of you have, at, well not a lot of you, like two of you, have asked why I don't put music in my videos and I just talk. I don't know how to get around all the copyright stuff. I really don't. <laughs> There's a way to do it, I just don't know how. Maybe if I get some more patrons I'll consider putting music in and then doing the work to figure out like how I go about doing it. Like there's probably sites that I can go to to like get music off of. I don't actually know, <laughs> so that's gonna be so we're gonna have to figure out together. But in the meantime, if you can possibly hear it, you get my video game soundtrack.
just kind of putting everything into that. So we're going to combine these just so I can keep track. <coughs> Excuse me. If I don't combine them as I go, I will get confused. And then I'll be like, why does nothing look right? <laughs> why does nothing look right? But it's all good. Alright, so we're going to go in with brown. Get this brown highlight in here. Jeez, Rex, that's all I hear right now is Rex screaming, boss! Girl. She needs some pigment in here. There we go. That's that's what I wanted. That's what Mama wants. So Mama wants and what Mama needs, and it's what Mama gonna get. So my favorite video game to play as a kid was Toy Story 2, Buzz Lightyear's Adventure on the original PlayStation. <sighs> that game is like a walking treasure tomb of memories for me. Oh my land. way of doing hair. Not a lot of people like it, but you know, it's okay. It's how I do my hair. So I go in with a watercolor brush. <coughs> We're going to test out a couple different ones today. Actually, I like I think we're going to stick with our, our huge. I always like to go in with this sponge dab brush. Because, I don't know, just to me, it adds a unique texture to it. Oh, damn, I was hoping it did. It did this. It did the mouse part, but that was it. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Well, hey, now we know. Yeah. Oops, I see some markings that I need to go back over. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going with this though, because I see a few. Ah, that's what it is. It's the flesh. Okay, so I need to go in and remove the flesh. There we go. That's better. I'm still finding some little, like, tidbits that were missed, I guess is a good way to put it. I actually need wrong pen. I want to get this painting done, but it's like at the same time, I don't want to rush through it because I'm really excited for what this is going to look like rendered in digital rather than what I did in the, the other. Let's see. Going with her eye. I want it to be a little green. I'm gonna go in actually. Alright. I'm itchy on my ankle. Okay. Itchy itchy. Let's see. I'm not liking that. That's, that is black. It's the texture. Not, not, uh, splash. That's what I want. That's what I was looking for. Because I want, I don't know what I want for this. I just want something. I kind of live for that a little bit. Try to do. Um, yeah. I want to do this though. I'm going to take 
these both together. Nope, oh, come here. Eyes usually for me are pretty difficult. Oops, I'm using the wrong brush again, my bad. Sometimes you just get going and it's like, oh yeah, I'm using the wrong brush. There we go. Clean that up a little bit. There. Okay. I actually want the same for the scar. Okay. Combine. Oops, not the pants. I meant that. <clears throat> I was going to wait to do the scar, but I'm actually just going to go ahead and do it. So we're going to go in with watercolor. We're going to grab that sponge dab. We're just going to go in with a couple different colors. We're going to go in with some reds. We're going to go in with some, maybe some oranges. Just to really get that flesh burned effect in there. Let's see, I'm going to actually use the pencil. Because I just want this bottom part to be a little, like, spread out. I've never actually used the brush form of that before, and I actually really like that. I like that a lot. Okay, so I'm going to take off that opacity, not opacity, take off that clipping layer. We're going to go into the skin. This is where I generally make a lot of layers. So I tend to do the face rendering in many different layers because I end up putting a lot of shadowing in. It may not even look that nice, but it's going to be awesome. I'm already at the elevator. Damn. So I like watching old gameplay of like old video games from when I was a kid, and I, I really enjoy watching uh, Toy Story 2 Buzz Lightyear's Adventure, and it's it's about a two hour gameplay video, and I'm almost done with it. I was like, um, I don't even remember starting it, it's just been going. <laughs>
Got to do a little bit. Oops, I need to add a little touch of detail to her schnoz. Like, very minute. I just look like I'm giving her a mustache for a second. Jeez. <laughs> the eye. Oh, my nose. I was sick a couple months ago, and then I'm, I'm getting better, but I still have that, like, annoying post-nasal nasal drip. And it's like, I hate you so much. I'm actually going to combine her because I am satisfied with that. I'm actually satisfied a lot. So we're going to leave her there. If I do any other touch-ups, it'll be to the whole layer in itself. So let's see. Let's look at Zuko. Did my phone die? Okay, it didn't. I went to turn it on. Or like, wake it up, I guess, is the... The term is just like loop. comment on a video and I don't understand the reference. I don't, um, uh, yeah, I got nothing. <laughs> okay, I'm just, I'm more confused than anything else at this point. So we're just gonna, we're gonna leave it and we're just gonna go back to Zuko because Zuko is like the hottest man in anime history. Like, if anyone tries to deny that, you'd be lying. Zuko was fine. Oh. Especially when he like went to the good side. That was like the bee's knees. It's not like I was jamming to that. Jeez. Need a little bit more brown here. I just realized. So I use Spill More Go. That's like my video editing app on my iPad. I have it on the computer now. I might have to actually use it on the computer because I notice if I tend to upload something onto my iPad more than like two minutes as an example, it crashes the app. <clears throat> and I'm not about that life today, man. I'm not about that. So I might just upload it onto the computer and do it there. <laughs> so I thought about it and I'm like, this is gonna be a long video.
Let's get his hair. Zuko does not have gray hair. I just need to give him a little bit of texture. Where's the flesh? There is the flesh. Okay. So his skin, we have that. I'm gonna make it a little darker. And you did. I also find it funny watching some of these gameplay videos because some of the times it's like, okay, you clearly never played this as a kid, you noob. <laughs> you silly noob. See, when I get a good flow on, I can just go. And this is one of those times I have a good flow on and it's just going. I don't necessarily want this to be white, I just want it to be a little bit brighter. A little bit of harsh lines on him. So I'm gonna take these harsh lines, I'm gonna take the gauzy blur and just kind of blur it just a little bit. Just a little. Let's go to his eye. Let's get some gray up in there. Get that gray over there. And then for him, I want to do the same thing with the eye. I want to take the eye, take it down here, combine those, then do a clipping mask. Because he has really pretty eyes. Like, they're kind of... I mean, they're, they're akin to a firebender. I mean, they, they look like firebender eyes. That's, I, don't, I think that's the best way I can describe that. Really and truly. I'm just kind of blended in between. Guys, I'm actually here for this right now. Like, I'm, I'm here. I'm here for it. Um, wow, I did not, I did not expect this to. Oops, hold on. I got a message that I think is from my husband. Except. That is not from my husband. Sorry, I'll pay attention to it later. <laughs> the only time I will stop is if my husband enters the room, so I can give him my undivided attention. Cause I like doing that. Like letting him know that he has my full attention when we talk. Well, that done diddly fucked up. So I've learned the hard way. You cannot merge a clipping mask to a clipping mask. So like if I take this layer right here and I try to combine it with this layer, we get that. So I've I've ruined many a drawing that way. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I'm looking at the thumbnail of the lair, and I'm like, why does he have an arm on his back? But it's okay. I understand now. So we're going to take... We're going to combine these. We're not going to merge them. We're just going to combine them to where they're one, and I can readjust the whole shape. Because I want to make them center. And then we're going to go in. We're actually going to get rid of them for a sec because I want to focus on this design. Do, 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 do. Okay. Rough outline. Uh oh. Come on. There we go. There we go. Send them a little here. Make this brush bigger. Actually, for my taste. Hold on, I need my glove for this. I don't know why I'm not wearing it already. So, for those that are new, when I talk about my glove, I literally bought a half glove that only covers my pinky and my ring finger and my palm. That way I can roll around on the canvas without having, like, breaks in between my lines. It really helps. Actually, gonna put this on a second layer that way I can manipulate it. See, it's getting those swirls right for me is where it's at. This is like sometimes you just don't want to cooperate. <clears throat> Foxy, no. We're gonna distort this and warp it just a little bit, not a lot. So we're going to get rid of those, combine that, put our people back. Ooh, that was not the right idea. Move them closer towards the top. Boom. Now, so I'm going to have to figure out how to do the bottom, but we're going to work on this real quick because I know exactly how I want to do this design. So I'm going to dark red. We're going to go in with our gold rush set. We're going to go in with glitter fill. Ooh, not need that big of a brush. So the glitter you have to build in layers in order to get the right effect because sometimes it just doesn't do the effect you want. So sometimes you gotta go in with like darker colors, sometimes some really dark colors when it doesn't want to cooperate. There we go. This background, I don't, I don't want that. I'm actually a little proud of this. It's not my best work. I'm not the best at character art, but I mean, I'm leaning. So what are you going to do? What you going to do? Do, 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 That's, actually, that is the color I wanted. Um, so we're actually, we're going to get funky. Let's funky. We're going to put a whole bunch of colors in here. I almost said the F word. I do that anyways. One more time. Gonna, we're gonna go look fine. We're gonna twirl this bitch. Gonna twirl, gonna twirl. And then we gonna take it. Try and game it. Ooh, 
I can blue it. Pretty sweet from the back, though. Hmm. Um. Let's see. What brush am I looking for? Oil paint. That's what I want. Like, I literally just want the background to kind of be like a spiral. Does not need to have any rhyme or reason. I'm just, I'm messing around with this to see what I like and what I don't like. Just lightly blending this with that same brush, the oil brush. Not gonna lie, I actually really like that. Um, this we're gonna combine, we're gonna make a copy, we're gonna make the bottom one black. Oops, I missed a call. That was a spam number. Okay, then I don't really care. <laughs> there we go, make that pop out a little bit. <clears throat> I'm gonna do something to these here in a sec, but for right now, I'm gonna take the pencil for Gaussian Blur. I want to use a specific brush. I wanna use Sponge Dab. Cause I want that, the bottom, blended. Oops, it's not blending. Oh God, that's not blending. Totally forgot my process. Pencil. Yes. She's pulling up backwards. That looks like she's cool. a bunch of stuff you want. Help. Yes, I am just about there. All right, hold on, kids. I got interrupted one more time. In the meantime, I went ahead and gave this my seal of approval. Um, I went ahead and put a little bit of shading over them just to kind of mix in with the colors we got for the background. So he has a little bit of dark red. She has a little bit of orange. I'm really satisfied with this. Um, I'm going to find the original and I will post the original next to the new one. That way you guys can see the difference because I'm really excited about this. Now for the long process of getting this video somehow up. <laughs>